Hi there, and welcome back to episode 10 of my Hazing Hidden Save. Uh, now, since the last episode, I did say I was going to come back for the first game of the season, but I accidentally played it with the recording, so I just decided I'd play to the end of the transfer window just in case I made any other transfers, but which I actually didn't. But anyway, as you can see, we've had a decent start to the season. We won the first game against Eastbourne Borough 1-0. In fact, I'd be better off than through the players first because there'll be players that'll scored. Right, the players we let go, Evans, eh, he was in a non-contract and I would have kept him if we could have kept him in a non-contract, but he didn't. He wanted to uh, join Rushall, so he went to Rushall. As my Alou, we let him go just because the second half of the season, none of our strikers done it, so we just let as my Alou. Elliot Benyon and Scott, Scott uh, Josh Scott, we let them all go. We also let uh, Tom C Collins go. He didn't play much, but but we let the three of them go just because they were a poor the last six months. They just seemed as if they always missed chances. Should have done better, so we just let them all go. And then we also let Adam Everett. He was a he was a left back that could play centre mid too. He was all right, but he wasn't great. Wanted something better. Now. Both our goalkeepers, Aaron Lennox and Daniel Lincoln, both wouldn't sign a new contract. So both of them left, which was disappointing because they were both quite young and decent. Lincoln, he's not got a jock club yet. I bet you I could get him off from a contract. No. Oh no, he, he didn't like me. That was his problem. And Lennox hasn't got a club either. They're both. None of them want to play for me. They must just not only like me. Jake Nicholson, that was a disappointing one because he was a good young, well, middle-aged player. Uh, could have been doing with him staying, but we've not really missed him that much. Max Wolfsford, he went, he left too. Uh, he's a free agent. He just wasn't good enough, really. Ed Sanders, he was a centre back in a non-contract. He just never played well at all, so we just I just cancelled his contract. Now I'm really disappointed with this one. J J J Dylan, I think is how you pronounce his name. I really wanted to keep him. I thought he could be a good wee player for us, maybe even up to League Two. But he was only on a non contract and if I'd noticed that earlier I would have offered him a contract, but he ended up going to Ketten in a few transfer, it was really disappointing. Collins you know left. Ashley Artwell I actually hadn't realised he'd because like, he was on a non contract too and I was just hoping to keep him, but he's away to older shot. What league got older shot in? Oh no, must have got relegated. In fact, not have been in. Oh, it's been a while since been in that league. I thought, I thought they were in the league two, but it's been a while since been in league two actually. So that's all the players that went out. Now the players we brought in, we brought in Reese Weathers Weathersbum Weath Weathersbum. I don't know that's how you pronounce it. Now I kind of bought him in to be backup, but he's turned out to be a. Uh, starting striker, you can see five games, three goals. Somebody for five finishing, that's impressive. <laughs> I don't see him continuing that, that's the only thing. The only thing, yeah. But brought in Bradley Wood on loan. Now, I'm pretty sure I used him in last year's football manager when I had done my, I'd done a Salford City save last year, and I'm pretty sure I had him. Uh, but he's going to be a decent right back. Uh, Bradley. Bun, bump, bump. He's a striker. He was the top goal scorer in our league last year at Oxford City. So I thought well, there's no harm in signing him. He's only scored one goal, goal in four games for us. He's had a lot of chances and missed a lot, but hopefully be able to turn into a bit, a wee bit better player than he's been so far. Joe Wright. He's gone. He's a starting goalkeeper now. Uh, it says he's only one and a half star, but he's got good handling, good reflexes. Oh, he's a wee bit poor with his rushing out, but rushing out is not too bad as long as you've got decent defenders. One on one's ten, it's not too bad for this level either, so I think he, I still think he's a decent goalkeeper. Uh, Joe Wright, and he's done well for us so far. Tom Love Rock, Love Lock, uh, he's another uh, goalkeeper they've got. It actually says he's better than another one, but I, I don't think so. But he's, a, he's just going to be back up this season. I've got both of them in non contract, so they might leave at some point. But I didn't want to pay, be paying them money every week if they weren't 
uh, going to be playing and I got like, I got low, a new sub co uh, thing that's like £25 a week or something so it's not too bad. Next one is James Comley, uh, he's a centre mid, uh, we signed him, got him in a free transfer, he's going to be one of our starting centre mids this year, he looks like a decent player. Danny Stevens, he's a winger that we got, we really needed to strengthen in the positions because that's, that's probably uh, why we were struggling towards the end of last season but he's done well for us so far, it was a good wee signing I think. Hmm. Hmm. Didn't realise. Hmm. I forgot about this guy. I was sure I'd signed another left mid, but I didn't know who it was, and it's him. And he's been playing in under twenty ones. That's why I've not. He's not played yet, but he actually looks pretty decent. Ashley King King Kington. He's an attacking mid. He can play centre mid too, but we're going to be playing him attacking mid. I think he's played well so far. He's had three goals in five games too. Sam Austin, he's another one that's disappeared into the under 21s. I'm going to promote him to. Uh, he's just another young striker that's got potential to do well. Sean Cooper, he's going to be playing defensive mid or centre mid or even centre back. Just any of the three positions. If we do play with a defensive mid in a game, he will be the starting defensive mid as we don't really have another defensive mid. Steve King, he's just literally a backup centre back. That's all he is. So that's it the transfers and I'll sh just go over the first six games we've played. We played Eastbourne Berlin 1 1 0. Danny Stevens, the winger, scoring in the 26th minute. It's ner nervy when you can only score one goal, but 1 0, that'll do. And then we played Sutton United and we managed to win 1 0. Harry Grant, who was here last season, he's a left winger, he scored a winning goal in the 33rd minute. And then we went to play Toru. And we drew 1-1, one, one. that was disappointing because we were up 1-0 and I thought we were going to get a third 1-0 win in a row and this and so it was a brilliant goal. I can't fault him for that, he hit it from like 25 yards and it was straight in the top bag. There's nothing we could do about that. And then against Moldstone, I started off attacking, or Maidstone sorry, Maidstone not Moldstone. Maidstone, eh, I started off atta attacking and it was 2 all, and I went back to standard because I was... I didn't have, I was probably stupid to start my attacking, uh, especially because they had round, round about us in the league, but we managed to beat them 6-2 eventually after we went back on to Standard, which is very impressive because they're a good team, I think they're going to be a good team this season. Kings, Kingstone, Stone Ann, Kingstone Ann, I think that's, I'm not even sure, that's probably not how you pronounce it, they beat us 1-0. As you see there, they play at the same stadium as uh, Wimbledon do, but, but Wimbledon are trying to move back to, to where they used to play years ago, but I can't even, uh, I think we were just unlucky in that game, that's all it was, we were just very unlucky. And then we went away, away, away to, no, at home to Farn, Farnburn, Farnborough, and we won 4-1, Rees Wood, Woodburn scoring one, Ashley Kington scoring a hat-trick. Dominate that game and deserve to win. So today's game is going to be against Brackley. Right, so we'll put, when we play Brackley, uh, the team that we're going to go for in this game, I've not done a team up yet actually. Uh, we're going to, no we're not because he's tired. We're going to put him in the bench actually. He seems a good player. Uh, Sam Austin can also go in the bench, maybe. Yep, I'm just going to bring off Lovelock, I don't think we're going to get an injury there. We we'll only have one, uh, we've only got two left and right backs, so that's risky, but we never got a lot of injuries last season, as you can see we've got a small team, but we never got a lot of injury, injuries last season, so hopefully we can keep it the same this year. I just need to wait and see. I'm going to bring on Stevens. Oh no, Stevens has one, never mind, that's alright. Uh, Right, we'll just fire on into this game. I'm just try double checking if there wasn't anything else I wanted to do. What 
hopefully we'll manage to win again today. Oh, normally away from home I've been playing my defensive mid, but I'm just going to, instead of an attacking mid, but I'm just going to play an attacking mid and see how we go on. And that Chimpendale, I had him last year. I'm pretty sure I did. And I was doing myself a city save. Uh, just want to double check. Aiden Chimpendale, I'm pretty sure I had him and he came to the Premier League with me. I took him all the way to the Premier League. That wasn't a good player or anything, but he just kind of got the job done. He, he was playing, he played quite well. I think he averaged about 7.09 in the uh, championship, which is very good for a player that was at the originally known league. And I think he did play 15 to 20 games in the championship, but anyway. Back onto our save. This is on extended, I can tell straight away. I'll play it extended off camera, but it's too long to do it on, or when it's on camera. Unless it's like a special game. Uh, there's not much happening in this game, I don't think. Fenlon, Grant, Crington. Come on. Good we pass. Fenlon. Grant. Williams. Kington. Come on. Oh, oh and he'll say it's a good pass there, but he didn't make it. Bradley Woods. Brilliant ball. Grant. Oh, oh she, she should have put that back to number six. What well, we did try to get another couple of players in loan, but they just weren't interested. It's quite disappointing because we've got a couple of decent players with a decent centre back we tried to get, but I offered them key key, uh, key player and he just wasn't interested. Quite disappointing. I think this is going to be a 0 0 or maybe just a 1 0 if I'm lucky. I'm going to go into control, see if we can control the match a wee bit. Come on, Kington. Woods, Cromley, Williams, Grant, come on! Oh, I should have crossed it in. Or he should have had a better shot than that. Just looked like he passed it towards the goalkeeper. When I tell him I'm disappointed, because I kind of am disappointed. Mambo, Fenlon, Grant, come on. Hmm. Oh, oh, I thought we were going to score there. Right, close them down. Right, I think I'm going to bring on this Barnes. I'm also going to bring on Sam Austin. A wee bit of pace up front might help. Just go, I'm just assuming they'll be faster because they're younger, but suppose that's maybe just over exaggerating. Come on, no! We have had more possession, we just not seem to be able to do anything with it. I'm gonna go attacking. Ooh, don't know if that's a good idea. Fluid. What else can we do? I'm going to bring on Kiernan and put Stevens in the middle. Because I think Stevens is a better player than Kiernan, so he might uh, change the game. Have a better chance of changing the game. I'm going to be disappointed if this is a 0 0. Although I'll be even more disappointed if we get bet. Oh no. No. I was a risk you know, to attack in and I wish I didn't. Oh, I really wish I didn't. Oh, that's so annoying. I just feel like that wouldn't have happened if I didn't go on, atta if I didn't go on attacking. I'm just going to need to stay on it now. 
Ah, oh, I'm quite annoyed about that. Just gonna go more direct. See if we can get anything. Ah, oh, I threw away a point there, I think. Ah, oh, damn, damn, damn. That would have been a good point, I think, actually, away from home there. Ah, <sighs> oh well, it's a long season, we're fourth now, so it's not too bad, it could be a lot worse. And I think this season I'm going to try and, I'm going to do less videos and just try and fly through the season, just to try and get up, get up a league, because I feel like we should this year. Eh, yeah, that's quite a while till then, we'll come back for... We'll come back for the goss. No, I went to a home game. We'll come back for the home Western Supermare home game at the end of October. So that's been it for this episode. If you've liked the video, please like and subscribe to my channel. That's it. Uh, till next time, I'm out. Bye.